All right, guys, so I'm super happy to come to you with this update, which I have tried to do three times, and I've had issues with the camera and it not saving. All that is not important except for the fact that it changed the day that I get to do this update with you, which actually is important. So one of the things that I want to talk to you guys about is um, when I first changed into these uh, Tray 5, this was a couple days ago. I think I'm going to start doing these updates a few days after I change because I feel like that's more interesting. I mean, it's, I know for a fact they're going to be snug every time. I know for a fact they're going to feel uncomfortable every time. Um, but the differences are happening a few days after. So if you remember in tray four or set four, when I put those in, they were snug. But the next day or two, the soreness that I had on the first tray actually came back. And I had a few weeks without it. Tray four, it came back. Tray five, I put in, it was just as snug as tray four, so I assumed that tray five was going to be um, uncomfortable, which the very next day, it was. I had some discomfort days one and two, but now I'm at day three and I'm not having any discomfort, so it's going away faster. One of the other things I noticed is when I floss, I'm actually feeling changes in the position of teeth, um, things that used to be, feel like I had to kind of work to get the floss in, um, are easier, so I know for a fact I'm seeing some movement. And actually, when I look at pictures um, that I've been taking over the last couple of days, I'm actually starting to see a little bit of a change, a change in the way my teeth look, well, which is really exciting. So, um, a couple of things I wanted to touch on, and I have some notes over here, so forgive me. Uh, talked about the flaws, talked about the soreness, um, the snug. So one of the other things that I learned over the last few days is some of the other programs. I've had people ask about things like Smile Direct or um, or Invisalign. And I don't know much about them, and I don't know if the programs are different for those compared to, to Candico, and if Candico is different from person to person. Um, but I only have to change my trays once every two weeks. I don't know if that's the case for everybody, but I do know that a friend who is doing um, Invisalign uh, has double the trays that I have, and they change once a week. So um, I'm not sure if that's just unique to me compared to them, or if that's unique you know, programs, or that, that's how the programs are separate. Um, but that is a difference. So for some folks, um, having less times to change is better, I guess. Um, because of that, it also means that the changes are more intense, for me at least. So that soreness, um, my friend didn't have any soreness with hers. Um, but mine having that soreness is now starting to seem like a commonplace. Um, and that may be different again for, for other programs. But as far as this time goes, the difference I noticed is the soreness that came on was... Uh, lasted less. Um, the trays are still snug to put on, so nothing's different there. Um, and one thing I did do is I looked ahead on my slider. I kind of slid ahead and looked at weeks five through, or trays sets five through 18. And I noticed, you know, as I scrolled through, and, you, uh, and I mean the, the 3D model they give you, where you kind of scroll back and forth between what your teeth look like and then what they will look like, starting on set five and kind of progressing from five and beyond there is a lot more movement that looked like was taking place. So I'm assuming that this soreness that's made its return is probably gonna be uh, apparent for the next few sets of trays. But um, just wanted to, I thought it was an interesting turn to have to, to do this a few days later. So I think I may continue to do it after I've worn them for a couple of days, just to let you guys know kind of what's going on there. Um, continue to leave your questions, leave your comments. I love getting to interact with you guys about this story. It's, it's truly been um, a really fun experience, especially to start to see differences in pictures. It's, been really exciting, so I'm really pumped to see how uh, things continue to progress.